Greetings to you all in the name of Jesus Christ. This is my testimony about heaven and hell is really true. May you be blessed as you listen in Jesus' name. Amen. Stage 17 After I saw my holy angel outside in my house, our God said to me, My precious child, this is your house in heaven. And I replied to Jesus, Wow, it's amazing, Lord. Is this true that you will give me this house? Lord, I remembered what the Bible says that there are many houses in heaven, and now I totally know. Everything's really true. Why are you doing this for me, my Lord? I thank you so much, my Lord Jesus. And I cried with tears of gratitude and joy as my heart overflowed with love and adoration for the Lord. I had never really anticipated such wonderful things from Him. I had always felt that if He simply noticed me, it would be okay. But now, He literally was showering His blessings on me. As God showed me the house, I stepped through the door, and I saw the house was made of crystal clear as water, transparent as glass, white as snow, sparkle as diamonds. The floor were made of crystal clear. The windows were made of transparent glass. The ceiling were made of white as snow. The walls sparkled and shone like diamonds. During the time I entered the house, I felt like I was inside in the body of diamonds or crystal. How amazing! An extraordinary this crystal house why it is so rare and so beautiful the crystal house is a scene of unusual beauty nothing on earth could compare with the crystal house or diamond house in front of me it is true and prepared place for us and while I was looking inside in my house our God said to me my child I have prepared everything for my children so that when they get here in heaven, they will live here as family and they shall be my people forever. Everything in my kingdom has been ready for a long time, but so many of my children are not ready for me because they love the world too much. That is why I'm showing you all these heavenly things so that you will tell my people not to love the world too much. Heaven is their true homes and not the worldly earth. I believe the Lord is ready for His people, but His people are not ready for Him. He sounds very urgent. That is why I must get this message out. I have no alternative. I am willing to be used by Him. I simply must obey the Lord. People need to be warned that the coming of the Lord is near and He prepared the place for us in heaven paradise. And people need to get ready for His second coming by repenting of their sins and receiving Him into their lives. And I said to our Heavenly Father, Yes, Lord, I will tell your people that heaven is really, really true, and you prepared the houses for us in here in heaven paradise. God opened my mind about the family in heaven. When they get here on heaven paradise, they will live as family on heaven, and each of family will live in their houses. They are family when they are inside in their houses together, but when God called them to worship, they will go in the throne of God, and they will worship, sing and dance, give praises to our God and to the Lamb. Inside the dwelling place of the throne of God, the family will be changed into brothers and sisters. That's God explained me in my mind. Truly, God has a wonderful plan and purpose for our life. He has prepared a home for us in heaven. We can discover the thrill of knowing that we are bound for the promised land. As I walk outside in the door of my house, I saw the whole beauty of heaven paradise, full of lights, full of gray natures, full of gorgeous trees, and magnificent flowers. Our Heavenly Father said to me, My child, 
You are very precious to me, and you have a pure heart. That is why I show you everything in my kingdom paradise, for you to know that I am your God who is faithful and true. I am the same God of yesterday, today, and forever. Be faithful, my child, until I come on earth, for I promise you that you and your family will be saved, and you will live forever in this house. You will be victorious, and I will give to you the crown of life, and I will write on you the name of my God and my new name. Wow, how amazing is our God! Instantly, our after saying these words, I saw my new transformation. My white robe was transformed into a heavenly gown, and I saw myself wearing a beautiful crown. And I saw the name of my God in my forehead. Though I did not understand the heavenly letters and writings, but God quietly said to me in my mind, My child, that is my new name. I was amazed and surprised because I never forget this wonderful name in my forehead. The heavenly gown was the most stunning expensive clothing I ever seen, and the heavenly crown was made of pure gold and diamonds. I felt like I was in a wonderland of beauty, peace, joy, and happiness. Truly and faithfully, heaven is our true home, and as I've discovered, heaven is so real. There were no words to describe the feelings. I felt that I didn't belong to this world anymore. I had walked into the eternal dwelling that Jesus had already prepared for me. I know I could never be the same again. Nothing in this world could compare with heaven, my true and real home. God's presence is the fullness of joy.